uh, I will tell you a hack that uh, I normally work with is uh, when I have to create a training set. So, for example, I have to predict okay, is this uh, text talking about technology, is this text talking about sports. The best hack that I do is because I have a good, very good tech team is uh, please go and scrape all the top 10 news websites of India and abroad. What you would get is if you follow Economic Times, Hindu, BBC, anything, you would get industry, uh, power, then coal. They have those inbuilt ontologies built in. Okay. And uh, what I normally do is I take in those, extract them, and I have my training set ready in a day. So I will have like some at least 50,000 rows of data in a day. So that is some kind of hack that you would have to uh, create. And there is another hack is uh, we talked about unsupervised learning versus supervised learning. So, supervised learning is where you know that this is a cat, in unsupervised I have to tell that it is a cat. Okay. So, what I would do is I would apply unsupervised learning on my data set, create a tag data, use it now as a supervised data set, create my model see how much accuracy I am getting. If I'm, I if I do not like it, I come back, I do again unsupervised learning, refine it, retune it, then make a supervised data set, rinse and repeat. So, these are the couple of hacks if anyone is interested that I normally take care in my uh, use cases. Because data is so scarce that you have to find ways. Some might be uh, illegal or uh, unethical but we take care that we are not taking any private data. We take only public data, which wherever is available. 